Welcome back to Tenorshare everyone! Sometimes when you press the power button and one of the volume buttons simultaneously, or you press the sleep-wake button of your iPhone successively five times, your iPhone will enter SOS mode. This is an essential safety feature that can quickly call emergency services and share your location with them. If you ever accidentally triggered the iPhone emergency SOS function, the worst thing is your iPhone getting stuck in that mode. It doesn't matter, there are a few things you can try to fix your iPhone. Method 1. To get your iPhone out of emergency SOS mode, try force restarting it first. For iPhone 8 and later models, quickly press and release the volume up and the volume down button. And finally, press and hold the side button until the Apple logo appears. This method often works. If not, try the next method. Method 2. Enter exit recovery mode with one click. In order to solve this problem faster and easier, here I use the repair tool called Rayboot. Connect your iPhone to your computer. Click enter in the lower right corner, your phone screen will change. Then click exit, and you can exit recovery mode. In this way, you can easily get rid of the frozen emergency call screen. Method 3. Repair with Tenorshare Rayboot. Sometimes, software glitches can be the culprit. If you still haven't solved the issue, try standard repair with Rayboot. This professional iOS repair tool can fix stuck in SOS mode issues without any data loss. Keep your iPhone connected and hit start. Choose standard repair. Then click download to get the latest iOS firmware. Well done! Now you can start standard repair. It will take about 10 minutes, be patient. Congratulations, your iPhone is back to normal again. All your data is still on your iPhone. Method four, restore with iTunes. If you have iTunes on your computer, you can still restore your iPhone with iTunes. This way will erase all of your data. So make sure you back up your data before you start. Then put your iPhone in recovery mode first. Volume up, volume down, then press and hold the side button. Keep holding until you see the recovery mode screen. Click restore in this pop-up, then it will start downloading the firmware that is needed. Once the download is complete, it will start the restore process. That's it. I hope this video has helped you fix your iPhone if it's stuck in SOS mode. If you have any other questions, please leave a comment below. I will be grateful if you subscribe. Stay tuned for our next videos.